Hi, I am Chang Guanye. I will present our work, What Makes for Effective Facial Point Cloud Classification, which is accepted by WACV 2022. And this is a collaboration between Fudan University and ASTAR. We human can quickly recognize new classes by looking at a few examples, which motivates the recent popularity of facial learning. Most of the current facial learning methods work on 2D image domain. However, its implication in 3D point cloud perception is underexplored. In this work, we study 3D facial learning systematically for the first time with extensive experiments and discussions. Unlike facial learning in 2D domain, 3D facial learning is more challenging in terms of irregular structures, subtle interclass differences, and high interclass variances. Because the point based module chains on raw data may generate poor quality feature clusters, as shown in Fig A and B. In this case, bottle and person are two different classes, but they have similar shape and structures, as do H can and cup, so it is hard for network to recognize them well. Therefore, based on the prototypical net, we propose a strong network to learn the more discriminative feature with the cross instant adaptation module which can mitigate the distribution shift for better classification. Specifically, the CIA consists of two major modules, the self-channel interaction module and the cross-instant fusion module. The SCI module is designed to learn the diverse features by modeling channel correlations to adjust the issue of subtle interclass differences. Formulary, core vector Q and key vector K are generated from the input feature F with two linear embedding functions. Then we can get the channel relation score map R with Q and K and obtain the relative feature V. Finally, we combine the V and F to get the rescue update feature. The CIF module is designed to explore instance-wide interaction to adjust high interclass variance issue by reweighting support and query features. Formulary, we first concatenate each prototype feature with its top k query feature with the highest cosine similarity. Then we employ two one-by-one one convolution layers to learn cross-instance interactions and output update prototype features. Similarly, we could also easily update the current feature by the CIF module. Moreover, to evaluate the performance objectively, we also construct two benchmark data sets, ModelNet40FS and ShapeNet70FS. We first compare the classification accuracy with the SOTA baseline on two benchmark data sets, where our method exceeds other baselines by a large margin, about 6% for one shot and 2% for five shot. Then we embed the CIA module into different future learning baseline and different backbones to validate the generalization ability. One can observe that there are consistent performance improvement after incorporating with CID module. We also perform ablation study to analyze the contribution of CIA module and use design to visualize the change of feature distribution. Note that more experimental results are provided in our supplementary material. To provide more insight analysis, we first visualize the feature heat map. We could observe that the CI module pays more attention on the fine grain parts, such as the cap of bottom and the legs of two, while the CIF module could activate in more diverse regions. As a result, the CIA module can highlight more discriminative parts and structures, which enriches the information learned from point count instances. In short, there are three contributions in our work. Firstly, we perform a systematic study and propose a strong baseline for 3D FSL. Secondly, we propose a novel plug and play cross instant adaptation module to adjust the higher interclasses variances and subtle interclasses differences issues. Thirdly, the proposed method achieved the SOTA performance on the two newly built 3D FSL benchmark dataset. We hope that our work will help further research in these directions. Thank you very much for your attention.